consider myself a lover, not a fighter. Okay, but today we're, we're mixing it up. Jiu-Jitsu class! Oh my god! I'm just one of the girlies, alright? You tell me to stay safe, I say stay dangerous. I'm gonna have my rice cakes, we're gonna get the carbs in. So, a little hurricane is um, is approaching the great old state of Florida. Her name starts with an I. I can't uh, remember what her name is, but apparently she's supposed to be a bitch. And I don't know, like, I'm not really a Floridian yet, so I'm just like, I don't know how to prepare for a hurricane. Like, do I just chill the fuck out? Like, do I just, I don't know, throw on a Twilight movie and then, like, call it rainy season? I'm not sure. It makes me nervous. I had all this stuff planned today, and I'm still gonna do it. Just know that we are currently in a hurricane. I want to romanticize my life a little bit more, and I, like, scheduled a freaking jiu-jitsu class. I'm actually really excited because, like, I don't know, like, I'm gonna be a fighter bitch, right? Not only am I gonna be a unit, which it's not portraying well in this, I'm also gonna be able to fight. I don't know, something about that makes me feel powerful. And it's funny because I usually consider myself a lover, not a fighter. Okay, but today we're, we're mixing it up. Also, I'm gonna do like a little ASMR get ready with me, so enjoy that. I don't know, this isn't ASMR, but I do, you know, I do a little bit of light makeup. Yep, I'm one of the whores at the gym. Mm. That's me, buddy. I don't leave my house, okay? And if I wanna put makeup on for the few times that I do leave my house, then let me. But I don't know, it makes me feel pretty and confident and strong and beautiful. And if that's gonna get me a great ass lift, if those feelings are gonna help my lift, then I'm gonna continue to do it. <laughs> I know, you're like, why is your hair down? Well, I just didn't like it in the bun anymore. So we'll see, I might do like a little Laura Croft braid in the future, but um, I needed to get rid of that. <laughs> okay, so I'm about to head over to this little jiu-jitsu class, guys, and honestly, I'm like debating of whether or not I should have breakfast. I'm a little bit nervous. Do I need to carb load up prior to? Am I gonna be okay? But I do know is that I really wanna try the new chick fil -A sandwich. <laughs> don't be mad at me, don't be mad at me. I'm not gonna lie, like Chick-fil-A hasn't had a new sandwich in nine years, and so the fact that they're bringing up this honey, pepper, pimento cheese chicken sandwich, I don't know doesn't sound like a white person made it, it sounds colored, okay? And I feel like because of my colored brothers and sisters, I need to do my job and try it. It's 570 calories, which I've already noted, it's got a lot of fat, okay? But I really genuinely think that I can do it. So I'm gonna be strategic, okay, with my food intake, all right? I don't wanna do too much because I know I need 570 calories at the end of the day for this sandwich. But I'm gonna eat it with no shame. Zero shame, okay, buddy? But yeah, so I'm gonna, I think, I don't know, should I grab two pre-workouts? Because I'm gonna do this taijutsu thing and then I'm also gonna go to the gym. Because like, guys, we have goals, okay? And like, taijutsu is cool and all, but I also wanna grow a fat ass. What do you guys think, should I have two of these? I don't know. It is very tempting. You know what, what I think I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna drink this one on the way there and then if I feel like I have no energy for my leg workout, we're just gonna buy one at the grocery store. Also, use my freaking code. Okay, you little sneaky booties, use my code, all right? It's TNA. I'm a super huge fan of Oxy Shred, creatine, for any of the stuff that you guys get on the site, okay? Just let me know. Also, I'm gonna link it in my description box for you guys. Quick, easy, one stop. You don't have to go many places. And then also, don't get it twisted, guys. <laughs> I'm gonna have my rice cakes. We're gonna get the carbs in prior to my workout and maybe a little bit more carbs for my leg workout. Because again, like, I don't wanna hurt myself, okay? I wanna be very safe and not dangerous with this. Put that hoe in a bag. Ah, 
So I actually got this bag from Timu. First off, I want to give them a huge shout out. Thank you so much, a little love muffin, for sponsoring this week's video. So Timu's one year anniversary is actually slowly, slowly, and when I say slowly, I mean it's quickly approaching as in next month, and they are doing a huge anniversary sale, guys. And I think the beautiful thing that I like about Timu is that it's extremely diverse. So whatever your interests are, they have stuff for you, okay? If you're a gym girly, they have gym girly stuff. If you're someone that likes home decor, they have home decor stuff. And it's beautiful because everything is just like super, super crazy actually affordable. I actually don't understand it a bit. It makes me a little bit concerned with how affordable it is because I don't know, it makes me feel like I'm balling, but I didn't spend more than $10. <laughs> but I'm a fan, don't get it twisted guys, definitely a fan. I'm gonna show you everything that I recently got from them and the things that I really, really love. I got this, it looks like a Stanley cup. They had a whole bunch of colors. I also got this cute, this is like literally my new gym bag. I just think it's like really minimal. I'm just like a fan of the cute girl. And then you guys already know, I moved into my new apartment. So I got a couple like home decor. I don't know what this is called. It's like a book base. I don't know. And then these flowers, like these little things. And so I am putting my room and stuff together. So I will give you guys a tour when it's all done. I also got like this super cute candle. It's just, it's, I'm not sure what it smells like, but it's not getting lit. It's for the vibes. <laughs> okay. For the vibes. And then I got like this, like this little plate. I'm going to place like all of my rings because I know you guys always ask me about them all the time. And then it's like a refillable hand sanitizer. It is super, super cute. And I don't know, I just wanna be like, oh, don't touch me. Here, have some. Especially being in the gym and I have like a super compromised immune system. Also, one of my favorite items that I got, give me a second, were these freaking smiley face house slippers. Like I already have a pair that I got from Amazon for like 20 bucks, I think. These were only a couple of dollars and the quality of them is just already better than my Amazon one, which kind of pissed me off a little bit because why? <laughs> Timu has literally only been on the App Store for almost a year. And it is now the number one free app on the App Store, which is just like, what? Like, how does that even happen? And I, I'm not even gonna lie, guys. I used to think that this was BS. Like, I'm not even gonna cap, okay? I would see people doing hauls and I'm like, yeah, no, that sucks. And then now that I have it here, I'm like, damn, like, I need to shut up. I was wrong. So I wanna kinda tell you guys about how the anniversary sale works. There are gonna be over thousands of items that are only a dollar. You're gonna feel like a stripper in Christmas. You're gonna save so much money. And if you're you're like a new Timu app user, you get these things called $1 Timu Gym. Ooh, sprinkle, sprinkle. Through my exclusive link. This is limited time, guys. Remember, this is only through the month of September. You're gonna be able to find products that are gonna be an extra 90% off, which is just amazing savings. So now's the time, it's back to school. Get your little back to school stuff, okay? Get your school water bottles, your bags, okay? I strongly, with my hands around your neck. Encourage you guys to download the Timu app using the link in my description box. If you guys have any more questions about it, just send me a comment down below and I'll respond to it, okay, Stinker? Let me know if you guys wanna freaking like what's in my gym bag. I used to carry so much in here, but you know, I'm refined now, okay? I'm a minimalist. Less is more. I'll see you guys with me. Y'all, it is real life hurricaning outside. I don't know if I'm supposed to be out here. I live life on the dangerous side. I'm just one of the girlies, all right? You tell me to stay safe. I say stay dangerous, okay? I don't know, I'm nervous. What if you like makes me get real physical? I'm scared. I am gonna get off this soon though because I want to listen to my audiobook guys I've been reading a court of thorn and roses and then I finished that one I finished a court of mist of furry mist and fury and now I'm on whatever the and last one is called god damn this book series is good I don't want to ruin anything for you guys okay but just you know read it like if you want to read for some enjoyment this is a good book it's like fantasy which is like kind of like embarrassing to say that you like fantasy but if you like Twilight this is that on steroids okay there's a good romance going on in book one and book two hey, specifically book two all right guys I'm in a warehouse so I just want to put this message out there that if I don't make it out um, it was not suicide Okay, but I'm in a questionable territory right now. I did find this man online. Oh. Hello. 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 All right, let's see. I check. Clinch. Good. Very nice. Knee. Mm -hmm. oh, good. Put it on there. Push. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't mean to get so excited. Oh yeah, I know you guys saw that. I'm a f kung fu master now. One, two. Okay, I felt pretty good. Elbow, good, punch, nice. Good. <laughs> I just really feel like I'm in like a, a, an action movie, you know? What should I do if someone's in this space? Push them off. inside position and yeah. control their head. Boom! Yes, it, and you that's thought... really all you need to know how to do is 
Like it's, it's the most useful part of Muay Thai, or, or this art in particular, yeah. is this space. In Muay Thai, we spend a lot of time here, and we fight over this position. Yeah, and you're gonna bring your arms in, you wanna get both inside. You wanna get this one? Yes. And then I'm gonna come in, yeah. And this is what you're gonna see in Muay Thai. <laughs> and then you're gonna see people block and cheat, you know? Oh! But that's the idea, is totally, what, what are we, what, what I say in the beginning, what are you protecting? Your center. center. Okay. So if you guys want to check me out, you can follow me on Instagram at the Mixed Grappling Philosopher, and you can hit me up through the DMs if you want to schedule lessons if you're in the Orlando area. Thank you so much. This was so much fun, and I'm about to practice on my roommate. She doesn't know it yet, but it's gonna be amazing. So wish me luck. Do, do I do anything after the session? All right. Well, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna bow because I don't, I don't know. I felt like that was right. So yeah. <laughs> okay. So I mean, I felt really stupid. I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I look stupid. As look like I don't know what I'm doing but I don't know you everyone has to be a beginner at something and it was very clear that I didn't know what I was doing but I had a lot of fun at the end and some of the moves bro maybe it's not coming off on the camera well but I mean I felt like I was fucking moving I'm coming for the knees all right and then I'm bringing an elbow in there so I mean I'm trying to like romanticize my life and just like do more things that are for me and for my benefit and that are just fun and out of my comfort zone and so like I don't know at first I was really nervous to come here but like I'm really really happy that I did and I hope that this can inspire some of you ladies to kind of go out there and do the same thing and like get fondled by a white man. My only thing about it was that like I mean I should have known that like we would be touching. I like mentally wasn't ready for that so like we were getting up and close personal and I was definitely smelling his breath and feeling his sweat. Other than that I had a great time. The next day. This is perfect okay. First off you look great. I want to try something on you and I want you to know that if you hit me I'm not taking you to the airport. I will probably still hit you. I'm actually really nervous. Let's go to the living room. Stop! <laughs> she doesn't know what's coming. Okay. <laughs> I'm nervous. Are you gonna hurt me? No! Okay. So he was like, so you put your hand here, right? On the chest, push him away. Uh -huh. And then when you come through, ooh! Sorry, I didn't mean to touch your face. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, wait, this hand's supposed to be here. Then you bring it back, and then you, you come down with the elbow, okay? But then at the elbow, you hit him with the elbow. With you, I won't die. It just needs to be more. I'm not letting like why you not? gonna wait till 10 p.m. every day when I get home and practice this? No, because that's I why you did it yesterday. Yeah. You guys will never guess what I just found out. Uh my fing gym is closed. Now, this huge ass building, this can handle a hurricane. Why the fuck is it closed? Look at this. Just empty. Empty parking lots. So we're gonna try this again, but now I'm at my apartment gym. Listen, usually I would just kind of give up, but I told myself that I was not allowed to have that new Chick-fil-A sandwich unless I worked out twice. So, I really want it. hard for that chick-fil-a i'm starving i thank you for choosing chick-fil-a can i do your guys's honey pepper pimento chicken sandwich and a water Ooh. i used to work at chick-fil-a for like six months it was awful green apples or red apples there you go thank you so much okay and there you go have a nice day you well. i'm going to sit and eat this in my car because i don't want my roommate to know i got this at least not right now <laughs> she'll find out later if she watches the video but she has instructed me that she does not watch my videos here it is what we've been waiting for guys it's 2 33 all i've had are those fucking rice cakes and that banana yep oh well that smells nice look at that that looks like food to me 
scared. Oh my god! What the hell? Oh my god. Now there's just no fucking way that Chick-fil-A came up with this. They literally have not come out with something new in nine years. This tastes so good. And guys, I'm not a chicken sandwich person, you know? I don't last meat and I just feel like chicken sandwich is just too much meat for me. But this, how we get this again? There's like jalapenos in there and I don't know, my cheese isn't melted, but I don't think it bothers me. And then I think there's like honey. Oh God, this is good. That is all for this week's video, Stinky. Now, let me tell you something. I saw your cousin and she was hot. Do so you let her know I said what's up? Give her a big fat kiss for me on the forehead. All right, she'll know what it means. You don't have to ask her, she'll know what it means. If you haven't already, please smash that like button and please, please, please subscribe. We are almost at 100K, guys. I want everyone to know that my cult is uh, just superior. I want them to know that we're coming in deep, hard, not flaccid. So yeah, I'll see you guys. I don't know if I'm gonna see you guys next week or this week. So we'll just um, we'll just kind of go with the flow.